once again welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel in this practical short video i will guide you for the beam steel reinforcement which is floor beam guys you can see which is designed under the slab the span between two columns is here guys you can see this is column from this column center line to that column center line the span is 30 feet guys you can see this is the other column so from that center line of the column to that column the span is 30 feet i will guide you for its size inside steel reinforcement grade of concrete uh, grade of steel grade of concrete uh, stirrup size its spacing uh, bottom bar steel reinforcement top bar steel reinforcement d by 3 steel reinforcement hooks details lapping length also they did some big mistakes in this floor beam so let me show you as we discussed in many videos guys that the first of all let me tell you the size the size is 15 by 24 inches this beam size is depth is 24 inches width is 15 inches guys you can see the first stirrup should be placed with the distance of minimum 2 inches they placed at the distance of about 3 to 4 inches so this is one of the big mistake it should be placed minimum at the distance of 2 inches okay next the stirrup dia is 10 millimeter it's okay other spacing is 4 inches at the distance of L by 3 because the span is here the span is 30 feet so therefore at the distance of L by 3 L by 3 means at the distance of 10 feet guys you can see the spacing is the spacing is guys you can see which is 4 inches if you see guys they did one of the big mistake in this construction which is for lapping length so the lapping is not allowed at the distance of L by 3 or L by 4 okay but if you require to provide the lapping length to extend the steel length for the floor beam or for the slab, so here at the distance of L by 3 or L by 4 we should not provide where we have more chances of cracks but you are able to provide at the distance of L by 2 where is 15 feet so guys this is the place to provide the lapping at upper portion not at the bottom portion here we have positive bending moment at the bottom okay guys you can see they provided uh, two steel rods lapping which is about uh, you can say about uh, 1.25 meter guys you can see they provided lapping okay so the lapping is not allowed at the distance of l by 3 or l by 4 but it is allowed at upper portion which is called compression zone at the distance of l by 2 it means the span is 30 feet so at the distance of 30 feet at the distance of 15 feet you are allowed to provide but you are not allowed to provide the lapping at the bottom portion at the distance of l by 2 because there we have positive bending moment where we have more chances of so tension so it makes more problems okay so guys you can see in this practical video i am showing you that we have three steel rods at our upper portion for this 30 feet span and four steel rods at the bottom portion one two three four bars we have at the bottom portion look here guys we have four bars and again guys you can see we have four bars okay you can see guys one two three four bars we have more at the distance of or at the height of this beam at the are the depth is 24 inches so at the distance of six inches guys you can see we provide it already look at here guys and at the top portion we have three bars so total here we have guys six uh, 11 bars the dia is 20 millimeter for each steel reinforcement longitudinal bars guys you can see the spacing is four inches at the distance of l by three guys you can see clearly hooks are bent on 90 degree so this is also one of the big mistake it should be provided on 135 degree look at here and the hooks should be provided alternately they already did it it's okay and the hook length should not be less than three inches so it's okay the length is okay but it should be provided on 135 degree they did it on 90 degree okay guys you can see look at here so this is the long section of this floor beam construction which is 30 feet span This is the other beam which is 24 feet. Guys, you can see this is the other beam. Here the design is same for both. Because the size of column is 24 by 24 inches. So look at here guys. We have 12 numbers of steel rods. Longitudinal bars dia is 25 millimeter. 
there is the other beam let me show you the other beam the span is same which is 30 feet look at here guys we have 11 longitudinal bars the dia is 20 millimeter this is the other beam which is 24 mm, 24 feet span Okay guys, thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.